Welcome back to Far Cry 5's Arcade Mode, the mode that can give you something really good, or the mode that can give you hot garbage. The Bounty Hunt. Let's go get some targets. Reform Schoolgirls 2. It's kind of spelled incorrectly, but it was done like that on purpose because of the character limit, or so I'm assuming so. Anyway, I didn't think that I'd be entering something like this. Is this a boot camp or something? Gameplay modifiers, no explosive damage, highlight NPC, targets visible. Well, it's gonna be an exploding time for sure if I'm immune to those. Find four corpses. Empty, more empty, and more, most empty. Well, I like the idea of most empty, so we'll go with that loadout. This will be my loadout, most empty, I like it. So, beginning the map, the road just completely ends right there all of a sudden, it just disappears. But I get a crossbow, so much for being empty. I get a bow, I call it a crossbow, that's just a, out of habit of Far Cry 4. Out of that game's habit, so just ignore me when I say crossbow, but you know what I mean. You know I'm actually meaning crossbow. I mean bow. Oh, now I'm getting a gun. This is like a secret gun that most people aren't gonna find. Oh, that's nice. And it's all because I was gonna try and break the map and run off. Oh, look, is this another gun? Oh no, it's the same gun, it just spawned back. The weapons spawn back. Everything spawns back. Everything's gonna spawn back. So now I have a shotgun. I've got a shotgun and one extra arrow that I picked up from the ground. I think it was just one extra arrow. I don't exactly remember anymore. Anyway, I'm gonna go in the boot camp. I'm guessing that we're going in to rescue women. That seems to be what the story looks like. I could be wrong. I really could. I'm gonna go on the other side though instead of the front door. I guess this is the only compound we've uh, come to this place from a plane. That's the story. And we're going to be entering this compound. I wonder, can I just wander off in the middle of nowhere? I'm actually kind of curious if this has been left open. Come on, tell me. Do something. Keep me in the map. Okay, yeah, the game keeps you in the map. Or the intended playing field of the map, so that's good. Okay, so with that in mind... We can now somewhat begin. Oh, this doesn't recoil at all. This is awesome. Oh, I missed. Wow. I am terrible if I kept... I had to fire that many times before I could finally hit them. Here, we'll switch to tap fire then. Hey, there's another way inside the base. What do you know? Who do you think would just leave a door randomly wide open like that? Oh, look, a one-hit sniper rifle. But unfortunately, it's not the fire... The fire rate is kind of crappy on this gun. Here, take out the, the enemy sniper. Take them out. Let's get rid of that enemy sniper. That way it makes it much easier. I don't need a grapple hook to get up this. I can just run off it. There's not enough... Oh, a real sniper. There, the real sniper's gone, but the rest of them know where I am now. So now the next question is, how important are your control zones, little soldiers? Or are you coming? Oh, well, this one's coming. But I have a shotgun. I repeat, I did have a shotgun. Well, wait a minute. What kind of gun is this? What do I want to take? Uh, you know what? I'm fine with what I got. You didn't give me incinerary ammo, so I don't really need any anything else. I'm going to keep what I got. Oh, there's a ladder here. Jeez, this base is so flawed if there's so many places to get in. So many places. Anyway, I'm in the base now. I'm only here to take out the targets. Hello, gatekeeper that has a handgun that just died. Oh, and you can't get to this handgun. I, oh, wait a minute. You said that I could pick it up. I saw that icon somehow. You know what? Screw it. It don't matter. I don't need it. Don't need it. Don't need it. I said I don't need it. I'm good. Okay. This next enemy who's in the prison. That enemy is also in the prison. This enemy is about to get neckbreakered. Or punched in the face and then the throat. I got a shotgun, so let's just use that. I have a shotgun. I think I'll just fire my shotgun. Why are my targets in the prison? Why are my targets being imprisoned? Uh, I guess I'm an assassin sent to destroy a base. Ow. Damn Chosens, they're so accurate with their guns. Yeah, I know you're a Chosen, you're accurate with your gun. Come on, I'm a player. I have main character syndrome. You can't be that torturous to me. I thought I had the most nothing, and somehow I have all these first aids. Oh, I picked them up at the start of the mission, that's why. Okay, well, I've almost taken out all the targets. There we go, all targets down. 
I can now just get the hell out of here. Wait a minute. Why is the waypoint on in the ground? The waypoint's underground for some reason. Not really sure why. Don't matter though, because I'm going to go outside. Alright, I thought I was going to be neckbreakering you, but I punched you in the f instead. Oh, that's a dead end. I'll, I'll just go out the way I came. Let's just leave the way I've entered in, so that way I'll be safe. Oh, and there's body armor that's randomly left on the floor. I guess this is supposed to be like a schoolyard. It's supposed to be some sort of school, but it's a preset building. And I'm leaving! You can't stop me! Oh shoot, you can, because there's- oh wait, no you can't. No you can't! I see the way out. I see the way out. I'm going. I have taken out my targets. I don't really understand why they were in that prison cell to begin with. Or even why I had to eliminate the prisoners themselves. It's kind of weird, but... Oh well, the job's done. The map is okay, I guess. There's a lot of gunfighting. I guess I can give it a like for that. Mad Cry 4! It's a Mad Cry! That sounds like the name of a movie of some kind. Well, I've never heard of it then. I've never heard of it at all. Well, I have a Mad Cry, and it's called Ethel. Kill, kill, kill! Kill, kill! Max, Spec Ops, and those are the only two loadouts. Spec Ops comes with an AK-47. Why do you have two automatics on this loadout? That just seems unbalanced. Oh, that one comes with an even stronger AK gun. Well, okay, I'm gonna choose the weaker one then. This is my weaker gun. Oh, I didn't pay attention to the bombs. That actually might not have been weaker. Well, this is my weapon set. This is my weapon set now. That's what I'm doing. And there's a desert. It's a big desert. It's a big, wide open desert. I'm gonna go up this hill. Let's go up this hill here because I can. And, uh, oh, I guess the enemies are there. Aha! I have binoculars too. My target is probably indoors because that's usually how the game goes. Oh, there's only three buildings to look around on, and this is the other one. Give me my targets. Just give me- I see one target. I need another target. Give me any more targets. Anything else would be very appreciated. Aha! All those enemies. All of these. This is like a very small mission. Very small mission in the desert. One, two, three, four. At least four targets are there. At least four. Now I just need to find target number five, and then I can get started. I bet you're the target, because you're a heavy gunner. Why aren't you marking? Something's not marking it now. Fine, I'll just aim my gun at it. That'll work, won't it? No, it will not! There's an invisible wall or something that's preventing the mark from happening, but I'm guessing that they are the target. Well, I got the remote explosive. Let's find out if there's an invisible wall there. Oh, I can't even throw that high. The hell? They're being protected by something. There's like a wall in there or something. Okay, you know what? Screw it. Gunfight is starting. Guns fighting is going to start. Let us start. Let us start. You're all of you can't stop me. I'm one man. You are a wuss. What does that tell you? That I'm better than you. That's what it tells you. Why are you doing nothing? Okay. Okay. Alright, I guess you're doing nothing then. I'm gonna take your handgun. Thank you, sir. I will take your gun. And I'm just gonna look at you funny. And then leave. See ya! Wait a minute. There's a truck here. Nobody shall use this truck. Because reasons. Because my reason is more important than their reason. And this is just a wide open flat desert because of course it is. Oh, but you can't leave the desert. Okay, so at least there's a way to keep players in the map. Usually people forget to do that. Yes! So we go into the next part of the base, which is just standard. Just standard. But it looks like there was a, some effort put into it. There's that enemy out there, which I'm assuming is also a heavy gunner, because, yep, of course it is. Every target's probably going to be a heavy gunner. Every target. Well, I can deal with that. I'm surprised that these guys aren't even looking for me, considering the gunfire was just right next door. And it, didn't they have the explosion? You know, there was a bomb that went off over there, right? You know, you, you don't really care, do you? No, of course you don't, because you're just busy doing your AI things. Well, then fine then. You do your AI things, and I'll do my decimal thing. This guy's going upstairs, and then I'm going to get a sniper. I'll take the sniper, please. Sniper rifle. Yoink. 
And now I have a means of fighting long range. Somewhat. If I decide to fight long range, that is. That's if I decide to. There's a guy up there. Um, this is probably where I'm going to get spotted. Do I have any cans? Oh, I've got a rock. It's not exactly a can, but it's a rock. I threw a rock. Oh, one of my automatics is gone now. I now have a spaz. But the spaz has, like, no ammo, so it doesn't really help all that much. Dude, I had a rock. See? <laughs> I threw an actual can that time. Where'd my rock go? Dude, you took away my rock. Don't. That's not cool. Give me my rocks. Or my, my can. My rock. My rock can. Uh, that is not a heavy. Well, in that case, he's, he's a dead man now. Now they're all looking at me like I'm doing something weird. They look at me like I'm doing something wrong. Well, of course I am. Maybe. I'm just being me. They're coming this way. Let's go! To the next building. I mean, let's fall down. And not die. There's no fall damage on. Can somebody explain to me how I survived that fall? I don't get it. What just happened? I should be dead. I should be very gone right now. This should this that should have been a game over. Okay. Okay. Well, I I almost got the takedown on that guy. I almost did. Got it that time. You were not my target. Why did I even take you out then? I'm going after the flamethrower dude, wherever they are. They're my target. Go, get out of my way, I'm after a flamethrower dude. Get out of my way, I'm after a flamethrower dude. Get out of my way, I said. Get out of my way. I'm going for him. He's at the top floor somewhere. Oh, there you are. There you are. Oh, the takedown doesn't work. Okay, well, I'm gonna shoot you in the head. That works. I just shot multiple times. That Not so tanky now, are ya? No, of course you're not. You're a fake. You're a phony. You're you are always a phony. This guy's coming after me. Got him. Take down for the win. Only one more enemy left. I only have to find that last enemy, which I have no idea where they put him. I'm looking though. I'm looking. He's probably not marked. The last enemy probably hasn't been marked. Because why do I feel that way? Well. Uh, they probably would have come after me, or I would have seen them already. Alright, let's get out of this building. Let's get out. Yeah! Aw, oh, dang cha chain takedown failure. Okay. You can, you can stop shooting me now. It hurts. I've got all these first aid kits. This is way too many first aid kits. It makes it so that I can bullet sponge almost everything. Okay, so there is a target in this building, back in this building that I had already explored. There is at least, well, not maybe not a target, but there's an enemy in here. There's at least an enemy, which I have not verified if they are a target. But I'm going to, because there's one that's not been highlighted, so I gotta check this out. Oh, they might be up there. They actually might be up there. Let's see. There. That will knock- that should have knocked them out of place if that was the target. If it was. Yeah, they're definitely way up high. Oh, I see them now. Got them! Okay, they were the target. Okay. With them down, I can now leave. I'm not gonna jump down there again and hope that the high fall damage doesn't stop- says, doesn't save me. Yeah, or I mean, the other way around. Was, that, that was pretty lucky how I managed to jump out and didn't die. Anyway, I win. I remember that my very first words of wisdom on the Journey Maps video, which was on Journey Maps number 78, it said that the best maps are often the simplest ones. And that definitely falls under this category. This feels like it's a simple map. And it feels really good too. It flows very nicely. Although I do think there's too many first aids in the starting loadout. It's not the worst thing in the world. This will be the last map of the video, and it's called Pitcher Lake BH. I'm not sure what the BH stands for. Um, battle height? Big height? Big hut? Big hope? Pitcher Lake Big Hope. Let's go with that.
Ranger, Hunter, or Tree Hugger. I like Tree Hugger. I'll go with Tree Hugger. Actually, you know what? No, I'll go with Desmol. Desmol has nothing. There we go. Oh, wait a minute. I still don't have nothing. I have to get rid of a few things. Let's throw this in the water. I don't think animals go in the water. I don't think they do. There. Now I have nothing. I've got nothing for what I'm doing. And I'm guessing that there are poachers. The story is probably poachers have come to take over this, this forest. And I have to go and save everything. Well, I'm gonna go find some weapons. I started off with nothing, but now anything else I find is fair game. And now I got a grenade launcher and some body armor. Yes! I'm all equipped. I'm all equipped to do some ranger battles, even though I'm a tree hugger. The tree hugger has brought a gun, and it's a pretty important gun, too. And there's only five bullets for this gun. Five bullets of ammo. Well... My five bullets will definitely do some work when I can find my five targets. I mean two targets. I never said five targets, ever. You don't ever have to quote me on that. Okay, so something is in here. It's a custom building too. This is not, not a preset building. This is all custom made. Oh, this is really nice. You think you can stop me? You can't stop a tree hugger. I mean a desmal. You can't stop desmal, the tree hugger. Desmal's gonna be hugging the trees later on, I guess, because the game says so. Yeah, I took them out. Are they, are they really just gonna let me go and stealth kill everything? Oh, okay, this one's gonna be a little bit more difficult to stealth kill. There we go. Got him. So these people are just doing their animation things. I might actually just be able to continue going without them recognizing that I'm here. Yeah, so far. Oh, shoot, I think they found the body. Let's just neck break of that guy. And we have a little bit more time to do more things. Oh! You have to use the. Okay, you gotta fire a gun. Because Joseph. Just go down already, Joseph. There we go. Now he's down. He's out. Is this breakable? Yes, it is. Well, then I'm gonna go up this way. Never mind. I'm not going up this way. Ma'am, I'm busy. Leave me alone. Break this window. There we go. I'll take the fall damage. It's fine. And I'm just going to run away in the distance. Oh, shoot. There's a sniper, I think. Let's go this way, then. And now I'm going to run in the distance. Now I will run out in the distance where people will start searching for me magically. This is a really beautiful map, by the way. It looks awesome. It looks pretty awesome. Oh, there's the sniper. There's the snipes. They find, they think I'm inside of a building. They think that I'm inside the building. And I'm just walking around as if everything's normal. More or less. They're trying to look for me. They're not going to find anything though. The animal hugger, the tree lover, is about to go inside and take out my bounty target. Gonna take them out. I'm surprised that if Joseph is the bounty target, then the other one... I'm surprised that there's like three different bounty targets that are not present. That's what I meant to say. There's only two targets. And one of them's a Joseph, and the other's a John, so why is there no Jacob? This Where's your brother Jacob? Come out, game. Yep, there you go. Tree Hugger Revenge! You want to destroy my trees? I'll destroy yours. I mean, your love. Your your awesomeness. There's a guy right there that I'm going to shoot in the head. Because I have to. Uh, you make me reload my gun, huh? So, son? Well, then there's this guy. Oh, I better reload the gun. I better reload. Okay. Get rid of that sniper, at least. Get rid of that sniper. And now that he's gone... Now that I've gotten rid of the sniper, I can make my getaway. This isn't really the direction that I wanted to run. I don't really have much of a choice, though. There's a guy with a bat chasing me. Or he was chasing me. He was. The snipers have been... Oh, I thought I took out the snipers. And now I did. I took out the snipers, so now it just lets me run away. There we go. This guy is gone and terminated the poachers. And he did it with Desmal's loadout.
You can't stop my tree loving. You won't stop my tree loving ways. I won't let you. You're not going to stop anything that I do. Now I'm gonna go home and gonna go back to my desk. And I was gonna try and blow myself up, but I was too slow. It's my tree! It's my tree! You're not touching my tree logs! And that's gonna be the end of this video. I hope you guys enjoyed watching. Thank you so much. And I will see you next time. Goodbye!